So we need to make monies. Uh, if I remember right, hi, thanks for joining me. Sorry, I just kind of jumped into there. Um, we need to make a bathroom, but in order to make a bathroom, I need monies. Now, monies. Out of curiosity, does this game work on mouse? Uh, no. Or on controller, I mean. It does not. The answer to that is no. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear them, but my dogs, you may hear my dogs. They are play fighting right now. They are wrestling. Uh, my fault, it's because I, uh, one was sleeping by my feet and I rubbed her belly and the other one got jealous. <laughs> so they, they are fighting. one cheese that the one that I rubbed my belly or rubbed my belly rubbed her belly she is the best napper uh all she wants to do is just nap <laughs> so it's, it is fun to bug her and in all fairness she is getting up there in years so I guess if I was as old as she was all I would want to do is nap too but she's, she's pretty adorable what do we got? Weird name for a road, honestly. 24. Uh, nothing but payment from here. Oops, I didn't mean to hit that. Or another time. Sharky can't make a bathroom because I don't have money. They have misspent my money on bedrooms. Down here. Check this out. It's refreshing. Uh, it seems like you barely know how to put one foot in front of the other. I'm not surprised. Excuse me? Tell me, child, do you reckon with a while? You flirt with the bazaar. Beckon the uncharted. I've been known to occasionally look away in the distance. No, I didn't think so. You don't look the part. You've never set a foot in a shadow darker than your mother's. If you think these lands are young, you are greener than the crudi crudest sampling. There is nothing to fear but those who fear nothing. What the hell are you talking about? Ugh, oh, fine. I guess I'm lucky to stumble upon something with pockets. Did you just call me a something? I hope for your sake that they're not empty. Say, you wouldn't happen to know anything about all the humans showing up out of nowhere, would you? I, um, might have had a hand in that? Well, there's no stopping them now, is there? Once they start coming back, they'll keep coming. I won't complain, business has been slow since that dreadful blaze. I didn't know the fire reached all the way out here. Oh, the fire wasn't even close to the worst of it, lad. The shouting, the anger, the pain, as if the gods were waging war over us. Maybe they were? Now you're getting it. Anyway, you might be taking care of the motel, but there's a clear lack of stuff to bite on around here. Something that old diner was a sweet spot for. If you can get it back up to speed, I'm pretty sure you'll get more people to come over. Tony's construction service. Welcome to the A24 diner. Would you like to repair it? Yeah. Step one, clear out any debris and garbage inside the structure. Done. 
Step two, gather construction materials needed to repair the structure. In this case, copper plates, porcelain trunks, and glass panels. Oh, looks like I got all of those. Yep, they're all here. Step three, get your butt to work. Who actually works the diner? Question of the day. I don't know any cooking recipes. Either kid. That's not true. I'm actually a fantastic cook. I was just being a dork. My mother wouldn't have let me out of the house otherwise. How's the diner repair going? Uh, going, going, done. I mean, done. You should know, child, there is nothing more treacherous on this green earth than humans. Those bald gremlins. They know nothing of this world, yet they, they consume it. The dark spirit will be angry with their return. You really freak me out when you do that. I suppose they do bring their own fortunes, which, of course, they don't share willingly. We have to become prey. We have to pray or become prey. Or scavenged like rats. I don't suppose you've had any, uh, bad dreams lately. No! None! I sleep like a baby! Yeah, big honest baby. Don't worry, she only bites when she's told. And there's no one to tell her yes. Or no. Back out of here. guest here. This little guy down here, me. Hi! In the middle of the desert, in a rundown metal shack, lived Gus, the most handsome possum by May 24. Seemed like digging through drunk was the main activity around here, and he was no rookie. Although, by the looks of it, Gus' primary concern remained his charm and driving wheel. Hi! Oh, hello! I'm Hank! Okay. Who are you? Yes. Nice to meet you, Gus. Yes, it is. What do you do, Gus? Not much. You don't seem to talk a lot either, Gus. Don't need to. That's fair. Well, just wanted to introduce myself. Not exactly putting your best foot forward there. But I've only got the two. Better start diversifying then. I think you're being a little rude. You're right. You're actually perfect. Thank you. What's with all the people? Actually, I might have had a hand in that. Good. They got the best food and bubbles. And they scare easily. A jerk stream? You don't seem like a jerk to me. Hey, watch your mouth, buddy. We don't take kindly to those types of words. Anyway, they used to roam all over the place. Reminded me of chicken. Stinky. Floating around afraid of their own shadow. Only stopping for the occasional turd. Living the dream, really. 
Oh, you might start seeing more of them again. Doesn't bother me none, as long as they don't stink up the place. And maybe, don't burn the joint down again. All they left last time was a scorched sandwich and a half a toilet. Fire almost got my little driving wheel, too. Love my little wheel. Worst part is, sandwich turned out to be a stinking leather book. Ask me how I know. How do you know? You're not really playing with the full deck, are you? I don't really like gambling. Lad, you got a nice thick skin on you. That, or you're as thick as gravy. Either way, I respect it. Thanks, I like your skin too, I think. Hey, what did I say about saying stuff like that? You don't do that around here. So what's a cheeky boy like you creeping around people for? I'm not creeping, I'm helping. Right, right, so making some extra beans on the sign. Getting a kick out of scaring their little mustaches off. I think they're pretty neat, and I like the building part. And my buddy Will isn't too upset about the money. Bah, what are you going to use it for? Buying food? <laughs> How come you live out here in the middle of nowhere? I prefer it that way. Just me and my diddly little self and I. I get it, you seem pretty cool to hang out with. Alright, enough. One more word like that and I am done with you. Are you done with your nonsense? Uh, actually, underneath that grubby exterior, I think you're secretly really nice. What is your problem exactly? I told you not to say things like that. I'm actually the biggest jerk you've ever met. And you're probably the biggest one I've ever met. There, he has a hat on. That would make him not so scary to the guests, right? The hair didn't, uh, the hat did not prevent her from.
Welcome back. I took out some content. It was just me doing nothing. It was pretty boring. <laughs> it's like mooching off your own future. All right, there's bathrooms now. Amazing. Now that your guest needs for immediate relief are met, we should turn our attention to the most important motivation behind renting a room in this motel. Being comfortable? Taking some time off? Repression! That's my third guess. Recognizing the insight into customer motivation towards your product is a key detail of modern marketing. You're doing the thing again. Why would anyone stay in this scum hole? Hey, I put a lot of work into this place. That's right, running away from what you can't escape. JD Pawn Shop Debt Collectors? Yourself. That's a little dark which is the perfect opportunity for one of our most popular facilities, a bar. That's worse, but not just any bar, a tasteful, sophisticated establishment, a distillery. How refined. We need more supplies. Let's run up and go grab some decoration.
participa uh, participants in the Pond Voyage and Pond Cruise programs agree to waive any claim for participants' personal injury or wrongful death. The most sophisticated distillery is ready. Excellent! You are one step closer to solidifying this establishment as the premier watering hole in this entire desert. Couldn't have asked for anything better. As we near the consolidation of yet another premium property, we obviously need to make sure our rigorous standards are met. Obviously. To the degree, you will need to satisfy a series of criteria. Now that I just got done making those beds, how don't can I? I wonder if I can sell the other beds. And no active guests at the moment. All right, let's go up to our little dinky cabin.
one done. Do uh, another one. <laughs> A little frog. I wish I knew how to um, sell stuff. Like, I hope that we can, because I don't want to keep those beds in my inventory this whole time. Yes, congratulations, you have once again proven yourself barely above minimum expectations. Yes, we'll now have higher expectations for this location. And we'll offer a higher payout in return. And then we got pants. Which we're going to put on, because it seems important. There! We are a pair in pants. Further improvements available at this location, you must now successfully complete the following task. Raise the siege level to level 3 in Timber Crossing. Would you like to accept this job? That's in progress. Please return once the job is complete. Oh, well, apparently we're done. Uh, is the job complete? Yes. Are there improvements available at this location? You must now successfully complete the following. Would you like to... Yes.
go grab some decorations. I should spin that around the bed. Okay, that's all I can do for now. Um, sorry, I got really quiet there. I was focusing. I was like hyper focused and getting that where it needed to be.
That's more hygiene. I need another bathroom. That's a problem. <laughs> I guess what guests come, come, and then we will worry about making another bathroom uh, after they leave and we make some money. But we'll go, we'll pop over this way and get some materials. I will give it, uh, I, I should say, sorry, words hard. Uh, this game is actually really relaxing. Like, there's nothing scary, no time sensitive. Even if you mess up and uh, have a guest who doesn't uh, like their room, it's not devastating. I spend more time picking up garbage than I actually do anything else, at least right now. It's like a good place to hide a body. Hey, you're too innocent for those kinds of thoughts. You goofy little bear. It may seem sweet and kind, but it's got an evil side. I made a toilet, didn't I? I did make a toilet. Okay. Confused. Hold on. Bedroom four.
Two. Two. Catch on four. Bedroom six. All right, all the rooms are filled. I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave it there. We made pretty good progress. Like I said, super calm and chill game. There is nothing uh, crazy about it. It is just, you just relax, you do your thing. No, uh, I like it. <laughs> I like the sense of humor of the creatures too. Uh, they're just, they're just being goofies. Hey, thanks for keeping me company, and I will be back soon with uh, another episode.